はい、あのー、ありがとうございました。あの私もまああの今でもコンサルティングをやってます。あのー、やはりそのまあマネジメントだとか現場のマネジメントだとか、あと現場のオペレーターだとか、まあこうやってやってほしいと。例えば一個流しだ、標準作業だと。まあそういったことをお願いしてもなかなかこう受け入れてもらえることがよくあります。まあ反発ですね。あのまあまずやってみてほしいと。まあなかなかそれが受けられないこともよくあります。まああなたの会社でまあ経営者としてね、まあそこをどうやってその収めてきたのかと。まああの新月のコンサルタントの結構やり方もユニークというか、アプローチも非常にユニークだと思いますけれども、あのそれをどうやってそのまあ。まあ、現場の方たちにその納得させてきたかということをお聞かせください。Well, I, I agree with you that most companies don't understand one piece flow. They like to batch everything.、Mm -hmm. and, and, and we did too. So、mm -hmm. um, I think the way that, that we, we learned and did things was just by doing a lot of Kaizen events.、Mm -hmm. And every time we did a Kaizen, We got such enormous improvements that everybody that was involved said, Wow, we, we couldn't believe that was possible. And, and I think, you know, it's really, I think Kaizen is learn by doing. You, you can't learn it in a book, you can't learn it in a seminar, you have to do it. Otherwise, you won't believe it. And so, we, in our case, because myself and the other senior management wanted to do this, We could just tell people, look, we're going to do this. And, <laughs> and so, and we're going to, and I'm going to use you to use you to help us. So, they didn't have a choice to start with. There, there, wasn't, there was no option to say no. No. And, and, and because it was coming from the senior management saying, do this. Okay. So, Shin Jiu Jitsu never tried to teach us how to run the business. They didn't. They didn't talk to us、mm -hmm. about strategic planning or any of that kind of stuff.、Mm -hmm. They just focused on the waste and how to remove the waste. And it was always done through Kaizen.、Mm -hmm. So we, we, we would, we would,、mm -hmm. they would come for a whole week at a time. And one consultant could handle maybe three or four different Kaizen、mm -hmm. teams. So we'd set up the teams in advance,、mm -hmm. we'd do the homework first. So when they came, we were ready. The first day to go.、Mm -hmm. And so、mm -hmm. by the morning of the first day, in a lot of cases, we, we were moving equipment around. We were, we were doing things like that.、Mm -hmm. And most companies in the US, you want to move equipment. Oh, no, no, you can't do that. <laughs> you have to have drawings, you have to have engineers. It's going to take, they won't let you touch anything. We said, no, go ahead and move it. Move it right away. And,、mm -hmm. and, and so、uh, they, they helped us to understand how to do that and how to get the gains out of that. Mm -hmm. So, it, it, wasn't, it wasn't really a problem for us. But after I left Danaher and, and left、uh, the wire mold company,、uh, I was in the private equity business. So, we bought a lot of companies. And I would be the chairman and try and help them to do this. And that was a lot harder. There was a lot more resistance,、mm -hmm. you know.、Mm -hmm. the, the only reason we could do it again was because we, we owned these companies 100%.、Mm -hmm. And I was the chairman. And I could say,、mm. do that. And if you don't,、mm. you're fired.、Mm -hmm. And I had to fire several CEOs because、mm. they didn't want to do it.、Mm. And I had to bring someone in that would do it.、Mm. Because in the private equity business, you, you had, you, the objective was to try and triple your money in five years. So we couldn't wait for someone to decide they wanted to do Kaizen. They were either going to do it、mm -hmm. or not. And、mm -hmm. if they showed us that they weren't,、mm -hmm. then we would move them on. Right. Mm -hmm. So, you're right. There needs to be someone who says, This is、mm -hmm. what we're going to do.、Right. And if you come in as a consultant、mm -hmm. and try and tell them and they don't want to do it, it's not going to happen.、Mm -hmm. They might allow you to do a couple of ties in.、Mm -hmm. and they might even say, Oh, that was interesting.、Mm -hmm. But then nothing will happen after that.、Mm -hmm. They won't follow up.、Mm -hmm. You come back you come back in a month and、mm -hmm. say, I can, I did, A month ago, we had this. It's not there、mm -hmm. anymore. What happened?、Mm -hmm. Right, I'm sure you see that、yeah. a lot of places, you know.、Mm -hmm. And it's,、mm -hmm. I think it has to be a problem for Shin Jiu Jitsu or any lean consultant. Is I think you have to be willing to fire the client. You、mm -hmm. know, I have to say, look, if, if, you're, if you're not going to follow what we、mm -hmm. say, then we can't、mm -hmm. work with you.、Mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. I remember 
early on, myself and Colin Insager said, said, look, whatever they tell us to do, we're going to do it, even if we think it's the stupidest thing we ever heard. Mm -hmm. And I would say about half the time, it was the stupidest thing we ever heard. <laughs> mm -hmm. And, and we, we did it anyway. Mm -hmm. And then it, about half the time, it didn't work. We put the cell in place or something, but it didn't, but it didn't work. And all of our people, they wanted to go back to what it was before. We said, no, no, no. We're never going to let you go back. Once we put something in place, if it didn't work, okay, it didn't work. Let's figure out how to make it work. And sometimes Shinji Jitsu would help us, sometimes we can figure out ourselves. But I think you had to have that attitude that, you know, you're going to change, you're going to improve. And the reason you you went from doing it this way to that way, mm -hmm. was because the Kaizen proved that this was a much better mm -hmm. way. Mm -hmm. Less people, less time, less everything, more capacity. Mm -hmm. um, and, and so you got to stick with it. Mm -hmm. And what, what mm -hmm. I see, in, historically what mm -hmm. I've seen in most US or European countries, is they could do, they might be willing to do the Kaizen, they might well put it in place. Mm -hmm. But if it doesn't work mm -hmm. right away, mm -hmm. they'll take it right out. And then go back to mm. what they were doing mm. because they're not comfortable mm. with it. They don't understand, mm. and that's why that's why it's been very difficult for to get a lot of companies mm. to really do this. You know. Mm. Yeah, yeah. They they just so so it's it's difficult you know? mm -hmm. because you know when you when you think about lean, the one thing you have to to understand is that every everything has to change. You can't just change the factory. Mm. You got to change what sales is doing. You got to change how you introduce products. You got to change how you do accounting. Mm. You got to change maybe your sales mm. job. So that because if sales and the factory aren't working together, then it's a waste of time. You, you, mm. you, you may have got some gains in the factory, <laughs> and then sales just order comes in with a big batch of orders and ruins the whole thing. You know. So.